Welcome into the Jason Tawney Show. I'm Joe Wamba. Joined now with Jason Tawney, head coach of the baseball team. Coach, you guys play a lot of games this weekend, you know, but splitting them in series that you really needed. Talk a little bit about you know what went wrong. Yeah, week. yeah. On uh, on uh, Saturday, we split a series with Hood, and um, you know, give Hood credit; they made a good comeback there in the second game. Won the first game four to mm-hmm. three uh, behind uh, Dan Williams pitching a good game. Second game. You know we're up seven to seven to four going into the last inning, and uh, you know we have a couple hiccups, make a couple mistakes, and unfortunately uh, that led to to a comeback uh, by Hood, and then uh, they took the lead going to the bottom of the seventh, and uh, we loaded the bases with one out. Bottom of the seventh had a chance, and unfortunately, uh, you know they they turned a crucial double play and, and ended the game on it. Uh, so yeah, it was a challenge. Yeah, those double plays, whether you make them or don't, can or hit into them, can be right. you know either. Uh, you know, a stint of momentum or drive you into momentum. How do you overcome that? Yeah, they they can be uh, game changing. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, and and then in that game we had a chance to turn one ourselves. Mm-hmm. And when you talk about momentum, you know that would have ended the game. And uh, at that point, they didn't have any runs in that inning, so that mm-hmm. momentum obviously shifted on us. And uh, as a team, we weren't able to recover from it. So so I don't know how to answer that question because <laughs> we don't always recover from those situations. And uh, you know, unfortunately, on Sunday we had a similar situation mm-hmm. and, and a similar outcome, um, and we recovered from that in the second game to win a second game. But uh, yeah, those, those are tough. You know, momentum momentum is in baseball is really interesting. We always say momentum's with your uh, next day's starting pitcher, mm-hmm. but within a game there are momentum shifts. Absolutely, and uh, making big defensive plays are a big part of that. As you guys move forward in the rest of the conference schedule, of course, you're going to be playing on Thursday and a doubleheader on Friday this week. And a very important series as you're going to be battling a team that you're neck and neck with in the standings right now. Yeah, this conference is kind of strange this year. We have two really powerful teams at the top that are are putting some wins on the board against Mm -hmm. the lower end teams. Uh, And then uh, us and Lebanon Valley, you know, are sitting there, you know, neck and neck. I was saying to you earlier, you know, we're we're in a little bit of a rebuilding year because of so many seniors we had Mm -hmm. last year. And uh, so we're, we're, we're pleased to be in this position. We'd like to be in a little better position because we've had our opportunities. But, uh, yeah, to be to be neck and neck with Lebanon Valley, um, you know, depending on today's outcome, they play Messiah today. Um, you know, Messiah wins will actually be tied for fourth place with Lebanon Valley going into the series. Lebanon Valley wins will be one game behind them going into the series. Um, I, I, the best news, though, and we keep telling our team this: the best news is we own our destiny. Yep. We're in complete control of our destiny. Yep. If we win the series and left on the schedule, which we're capable of doing, then we're fine. Mm-hmm. Uh, we just need to we need to do that, and we've we've shown promise. We've start, we we've started to hit the ball a lot better here in the mm-hmm. last couple of days. Um, I think the warm weather helps, but uh, we we've shown the promise there. We just need to put it all together. And I, I honestly, I said it. I think I said it last week. I'm hoping the uh, momentum and uh, the fact that we're starting to play a little better now leads us through the last three weeks of the season and into the conference tournament. Conference tournaments are won by teams that are hot, mm-hmm. not necessarily the best team. The team yep. that's the hottest. Right. So we're hoping we'll be the hottest team going into the tournament. You guys definitely were uh, pretty hot last week. You guys were on a little bit of a win streak. And then uh, little bumbles in the bullpen a little bit. Uh, you're going to be changing some things up. How do you get back into that winning mode uh, that you had last week? Well, you know, it's it's interesting because, uh, you know, last week, even though we had won five in a row, um, and our team knew this, and we had this discussion, we didn't particularly play well. Mm-hmm. Uh, we were not hitting the ball very well. Mm-hmm. Um, so we were we were finding ways to win ball games, which was great. Um, we'd like to find ways to win ball games while playing well. Yeah. It would be nice. Um, you know, so we're hoping to get back on that streak a little bit. Like I said, this weekend, we definitely hit the ball a lot better against Lynchburg and Hood. Um, so we, we see that coming along. Uh, we are going to make a couple adjustments in our pitching staff. Our bullpen has been has been a struggle this year. Mm-hmm. It's just there's no way around it. It's been a struggle. So we're going to make a couple adjustments and hopefully going into this series, uh, we'll be a little stronger in the pen um, and then stronger into next weekend as well. And then those guys would have experience if you guys would make the playoffs and have a yeah, playoff absolutely. run. Yeah, we, we the adjustments we're making. You know, we're gonna we're gonna play with our rotation a little bit. We've got um, we got a, we got a, a couple guys that are hot mm-hmm. starters right now and. You know, even yesterday we had one of our, uh, our 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 relievers throw five innings in relief. Um, had only thrown one one inning all year That's and a lot. five innings and threw threw the ball terrific. You know, guys like that, you know, are, are stepping up and making mm-hmm. some uh, making making us readjust some things. Um, but yeah, that we're hoping we're hoping that that'll lead us right. into the the next next part of the season. They're making you have to evaluate for the good, Absolutely. not because of 
poor play or anything absolutely like that. absolutely we love that yeah you're right <laughs> well coach we wish you the best of luck this week and uh good luck in these series you got coming up thank you he's jason tawny i'm joe wamba and this has been the jason tawny show